The sound of two-stroke engines first thing in the morning may not be everyone's ideal start to the day, but for budding motocross enthusiasts, it's their biggest chance to learn from the best on National Day. Top Emirati rider Mohamed Al-Balushi believes his own trophy-laden success relies on what he gives back to the community. We are doing a little bit of give back to the motocross community on this awesome day, trying to bring everybody together and coach them, teach them about motocross. You will notice uh, three colors in the track, red and yellow and green, like the traffic lights. So it's very simple. I need to apply the throttle until the red, until you see red. From red to yellow, you apply your brakes. And then from yellow, to green, you coast. If they learn something from you, you are connected for life. Today, uh, I've seen a couple of guys improve quite a lot, and this makes me really happy, because like, okay, I've done my job. As the first Emirati to ever take part in the formidable Dakar Rally, Mohammed owes a lot of his success to the Abu Dhabi Sports Council, who have played an integral part in his journey. They decided to support me, to go ahead, and we signed for two years, and I'm very happy and proud because a lot of people think when you are in Marathi you get everything handed to you, which is not the case. I really worked hard for everything I have. It's not only Mohammed that keeps the kids' engines running. His team and the parents' input are just as important. I always ask for their help because to have a track like this, me and my guys, is not enough. Mm -hmm. And they are such cool parents here and they all understand this and they all welcome the information and they're trying to improve. By improving them, it improves the sport. You see, most of the guys they learn today and some of them have some ideas, some of them have no clue. But if you come one season from now, you will see them, they are mechanics. I have a very, very hands-on approach, a very hands-on approach in terms of helping the kids, helping fix the bikes, just any, anything that the uh, kids need to ride including, of course, assisting the trainers. Mentoring these young daredevils has reminded Mohammed of why he first started riding. You feel free, you know. Uh, from the first time I rode, I felt liberated, I felt free. Felt really invisible when you put on the helmet. You are nobody, you know, and this is really good feeling. 